Hey guys, today I'm going to show you a few ways in how you can speed up your computer without having to upgrade any of the different components of it. And this is basically just going to, you know, delete a few things and it's going to move a few things around, but obviously it won't affect any of your file locations or anything like that. It'll just do a few, you know, in computer things and it'll, you know, make it a little bit faster and things should load a bit quicker thanks to the help of a few little programs. The first little program I'm going to bring up is Disk Cleanup. This is a pretty decent program. It just goes through all the, you know, little temporary files and things like that and it'll show you, you know, how much you've got in and then maybe different things and, you know, how much you can get rid of and potentially help and what this does is it just frees up different spaces from your computer which you know these files aren't particularly important and you can just get rid of these of your computer because you might forget to you know maybe like delete your history and delete your temporary files from different websites because believe it or not all these take up well can take up quite a decent amount of space on your computer so I'm just going to show you how to use it it's going to ask you which drive that you want to do and this one's my main driver, so I'm just going to click OK on this. And it's going to calculate all the different places it can go, and it's going to see how much space that I can, you know, theoretically delete. This can take some time, so I'll skip to the end, and then I'll show you what happens when this is done. Right, welcome back. Uh, right, it's calculated all the different spaces. I can potentially get rid of things. And as you can see, there's like a few 10 megs about. And all of this is pretty much not that important, otherwise, it wouldn't recommend that you, you know, delete any of them. Temporary internet files, just things like that. And some of them, you know, haven't even got anything in. So you're just going to go to OK and then delete files. And what this is going to do is it's going to just get rid of them. And then it's not obviously going to speed your computer up, but it's going to get you know get you some more space on your hard drive, and you know you'll be able to use that. The next program I'm going to show you is the program which is going to move different things into different parts of storage. It won't affect your storage locations on the user interface, but it just helps the computer store information in different places and makes it a lot more efficient in what it does. And this is Disk Defragmenter. As you can see. Well, I'm going to click here and then just click analyze. This is going to go through all of my my hard drives and then see which parts are fragmented, which means the information scattered and that means it's slower to get to. And I haven't, you know, done this in about a week, but you might find if you've never done this on your computer that you'll see it's very very fragmented. And analogics this defragmenter is a lot better than the Windows Vista one you get with it because it's very poor you can't see any progress that it's doing it just says it's doing it and I don't really find any difference when it has com completed so I would recommend getting this one it's completely free I believe you can get it from download.com but this program what it does is it's gonna send information into different places and then at this your files become a lot faster to get to and I find even on start off that the computer starts, you know, going a lot quicker. As you can see, after you know, just frequent usage, this is what can happen to your computer. I'd recommend doing this after you've done your disk clear, because you know, it's removed a few files and things like that. Some of them the files cannot be moved, obviously, but uh, you'll see how much is fragmented, and then just hitting defrag and having all these ticked, it'll work away and store these files in better locations so it'll access it quicker and what I find is it can increase the speed of your computer by quite a decent bit so I would recommend you know doing this you know maybe once a week and you know if you haven't done it well ever you'll find a significant difference in the speed that your computer goes but it's just a few ways in which your computer can be you know sped up and made more efficient by not even adding anything to your spec at all. Oh. If you want more videos like this, go for it and subscribe e to my channel. You are like e this is not true. See you guys next time. L double E D E S. I can I, I, I can put it down, put it down. I can I, I, I can put it down, put it put it down. I can I, I, I can put it down, put it down. I can I, I, I can put it down, put it put it down.
I'm always on the grind with money on my mind. I gotta make it big, cause I quit my nine to five. <clears throat> mind if I apply what I dropped out of high school and now I need a job. How you gonna tell me that I'm never qualified? About to dumb it down and make a living off rhymes, y'all.